a mass vaccination clinic today focusing on educators. Gabby Easterwood visited the clinic today as these teachers got their second dose. She joins us now live from the Civic Center in downtown Mobile. And Gabby, you spoke to some of the teachers there today. What did they have to say about getting the shot? Well, all of the educators I spoke to, Amber, had very positive attitudes of finally getting that second dose and now being fully vaccinated so they can feel safer going to the classroom to make sure they are healthy as well as their students. All right, that's it. Yay. Educators getting their second doses today, including Sterling Spencer, an English teacher at Grand Bay Middle School. I am extremely excited to have my second dose of the vaccine and know that I'm going in and not only am I safe, but in a way I'm also showing my students that it is safe to take things like vaccines. You should trust the science for things and you need to make sure you're making informed and smart decisions. As an educator, Spencer feels getting the vaccine is a responsibility. I think it will. I think for many people, the worry of us getting sick extends beyond just our health, but in a way where we have to think about how that's going to affect how we're going to be able to teach, whether or not that means our students will be behind on something. It gives us a moment of respite in this kind of time, and I'm happy to have it. Not all of the over 2,000 who drove through to be vaccinated today were teachers. But today, an added day to their normal Monday through Friday clinic set with educators in mind. We wanted to make sure that we made it easy for them and their schedules. You know, it's not very easy for teachers to leave their classroom of 30 kids, and that's why we did this on a Saturday for them, um, because we felt like it would work well for their schedule. There are concerns with the mask mandates set to expire during the school year and the timing for children to be able to get the vaccine being unknown. But overall, it's an optimistic feeling as educators like Spencer headed out of the Civic Center and into the classroom, now fully vaccinated. I encourage anyone who can and is able to get the vaccine to do so. It'll help curb it and it will also be all safer that way. In Mobile, I'm Gabby Easterwood at WKRG News 5. Now, this was not the only vaccination clinic that USA Health held. There was also one over in Robertsdale this week for the Baldwin County Public School System where they vaccinated over 2,200 of their employees. So all of this really just to aim for those people in those classrooms, the students and the teachers to feel more safe. Reporting live in downtown Mobile, I'm Gabby Easterwood at WKRG News 5.